Hi, welcome to Times TV. Please press the subscription button right now and hit the notification bell. Tag along as we bring to you the latest gist of today. Rihanna's laundry line raises $150 million in Series B funding. Private equity firm L. Catterton will put money towards retail expansion of Savage and Fenty. Rihanna's stake is now estimated to be around $375 million US dollars. Last week, the company announced it was putting a hold on her Fenty fashion brand less than two years after its launch. Insiders say the company plans to concentrate on Fenty beauty and Fenty skin products instead. The beauty brand saw $558 million worth of sales in its full year operations in 2018 and could be the global market leader of beauty products by 2025. Former Nigerian Finance Minister Ngozi Okonjo Iweala has been appointed as the next Director General of the World Trade Organization. She is the first African to occupy the position and the first black woman. A former director of the World Bank who was educated at Harvard and has a PhD in regional economics and development. She replaces Roberto Azevedo who stepped down last month. She is the recipient of numerous awards including honorary doctorate degree from the Trinity College Dublin. She led a team that negotiated the cancellation of 60% of Nigerian external debt with the Paris Club. According to a statement by the WTO, her appointment takes effect on the 1st of March 2020. Initially, there was a delay when former President Donald Trump refused to back her on the job. The new United States administration led by Joe Biden renewed hopes that an African would lead the WTO. The appointment was finally cleared after South Korea's trade minister, Yo Young Hee, dropped out of the race. Following a selection process that included eight candidates, the World Trade Organization's General Counsel appointed Okonjo Iwala at a special meeting on February 5, 2021. Her appointment is now officially confirmed. Iroko TV plans to go public on the London Stock Exchange. The company plans to raise 30 million United States dollars or less than it did in January 2016. What we can achieve in private, we can equally achieve in a public company, says co-founder Jason Ujoko. Iroko TV is regarded as one of the largest streaming services in Africa, featuring mostly Nigerian and Guinean movies. The company saw its subscription drop by 70% during the imposition of lockdown measures by governments across the sub-region. However, subscriptions in the United States of America and the United Kingdom saw a remarkable 200% growth in the last 12 months and helped financially cushion the company as it gears up for growth in 2021. Obi-Wan no KK, a young Nigerian cyber criminal, has pleaded guilty and was jailed for 10 years for $11 million cyber fraud. The FBI stated in a statement that Obi-Wan no KK and six others were involved in the crimes, which included wire frauds between 2015 to 2019 while disguising as a successful business entrepreneur. He was arrested by the FBI at the Dulles International Airport in Virginia in August 2019 during a visit to the United States of America. Before his visit to the US, the FBI had received complaints from Unitrack, a British company, an international subsidiary of Caterpillar, the heavy earth-moving equipment manufacturers. Obi-Wan was said to have defrauded the British company and some top American companies of huge sums of money. According to the FBI, the court heard that he engaged in a multi-year global business email and computer hacking scheme that cost a staggering $11 million in losses to his victims. 33-year-old Obi-Wan Okeke is the founder of Invictus Group which has investments in constructions, agriculture, oil and gas, telecoms, and real estates in Nigeria.
In 2016, he was named by Forbes Africa as one of the 30 entrepreneurs under 30 to watch. The Nigerian entrepreneur has been widely celebrated not only in his country but across the continent. Recently, he was listed among 100 most influential young Africans of 2018. This brings us to the end of this episode. Please like and share our channel with friends. Thanks for watching. Stay safe and goodbye.